A Toronto pro boxer has been arrested in the popular Mexican resort community of Playa del Carmen after two Vancouver women were severely beaten over the weekend. Peter Nowacek is in custody tonight while the women recover from their injuries. And a warning, some viewers may find the content in the following report disturbing. Sean O'Shea reports. My nickname is The Heartbreaker. I'm from Toronto, Ontario. His real name is Peter Nowacek. Lights are fire. Two years after turning pro, this 27-year-old Toronto boxer is now in trouble in Playa del Carmen, Mexico, after two Vancouver women were beaten badly on Saturday night. It all started when Jamie Coots and a friend were at the Coyote Lounge Bar. She was getting repeatedly hit on by this guy and she turned him down. But Coots and a friend say the man wouldn't take no for an answer and got violent. He turned around as if he was like walking away and then he ran at her full speed and punched her until she was like unconscious. Prosecutors released this photo of Nowacek under arrest. Local police posted their own pictures of the suspect whose boxing career started here. I train at Cabbage Town in downtown Toronto. Ray Morales is my main coach. Morales ran the Cabbage Town Boxing Club off Parliament Street. The youth centre where it's based has been closed for a year because of termites. But Morales is still active. In fact, he's now a Czech's trainer. We tracked him down in Mexico. I know what you call him, but at this point I have no comments. Okay, are you still working with the, with the boxer? I'm just asking right now as a friend for him. Okay. He's a friend of mine. Kutz's nose is broken in three places. Friends say she has difficulty breathing. One of her teeth was chipped. Her friend needed stitches to her head. She may have suffered a concussion. Another friend told Global News Kutz may not be given medical clearance to fly back to Vancouver for weeks. Mexican getaway was supposed to last six days, and Kutz didn't have travel insurance. A GoFundMe campaign to raise money for expenses surpassed its $23,000 target. Jamie is like the most like bubbly person I know, like just such a like sweet girl. The Canadian boxer accused of causing her injuries is facing Mexican justice two years after he turned professional and said this. My long-term goal is to become a world champion. We spent the afternoon back and forth with Mexican prosecutors. In Playa del Carmen, the Attorney General's office has just confirmed that Nowichuk remains in custody in the resort community today, that he is awaiting a court hearing. No date has yet been set, and under Mexican law, the exact charges won't be spelled out until that hearing, but they are expected to be serious against the man who called himself the heartbreaker. Tracy. Just a disturbing story. Thank you, Sean.